hi guys welcome back to my channel it's your boy louis if you're just stopping by for the first time please don't forget to subscribe give this video a thumbs up like my other videos watch them share them with your friends because you know sharing is caring and also don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever i post the video so in today's video i'll be showing you how to do pixie cuts so if this is what you're interested in this video is definitely for you and you need to keep watching So here I have my cap. This is the cap I'll be using for today's video. And also I have my extension. So I'll be using the premium quality hair in color 1B. And then I have my um, rattle comb, my needle and thread, my razor blade, and also my T pins. So I'm going to put my wig cap on my canvas here and then use my T-pins to like secure it down. So then after that, I'm going to turn the wig cap and sorry, the canvas head and then adjust my wig cap. So because I don't want it to be really big on my client, so I'm going to pull it down as seen in the video and use the T-pins to secure it down. And then drag the the wig cap down to where i secured earlier and then use a t-pin to hold them both on the on both sides then after that i'm going to get my needle and thread and then stitch it before i start you know installing the hair So I'm going to get the extension and then get my razor blade and split it. So this is how I'll be fixing the hair on my cap. So I like to split first before I start installing so the hair can be really flat. So these are the hairs I splitted. So I'm going to start installing now. So I'll be doing them in steps and make sure they're close to one another.
So now I'm going to get one and start installing it in front just as seen in the video. So then once I get to the other end, I'm going to return the hair backward and then fix it on um, the back and then go over to the front again and do more. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I post a video.
So to finish it up, I'm going to sew it round just like I have been sewing. Then I'll make sure that part is really clean and then flat. So now, as soon as I'm done um, sewing the hair, I'm going to like trim it a bit so that it will be a lot easier when I am styling it on my client's head. So then after trimming it, I, I'm making sure I'm not doing a lot so that um, once she comes, I'm going to like follow her structure and then, you know, cut it very well. So once I'm done with this, I'm going to hold down until she comes for fitting and also pick up.
If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and also turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever I post a video. Hi guys so my client is here and the wig is already on her head so i'm just gonna go on and then trim the hair So now we're moving on to the pack. She requested it be very short. So I'm just going in with my scissors to make sure everything is well leveled and really short just like she wanted. So I'll be using my scissors. This scissors has like um, a tooth. So I'm just going to use it to like reduce the hair in front. So I already have my argan oil on the hair, so I'm going to get my blow dry brush and then get my blow dryer and then blow dry the back so it can be really flat. So then after that I'm going to get my ultra hold spray and then set the hair
hi guys i hope this video was really insightful and you guys really enjoyed it please if you're yet to subscribe to my channel don't forget to do that before you leave and also give this video a thumbs up like my other videos watch them share them with your friends because you know sharing is caring and also turn on the notification bell so you'll be notified whenever i post a video i love you all and i'll see you in my next video bye bye